welcome to our channel so uh, this is another case study we are doing okay so identify the defect in arrow one so uh, this arrow is uh showing showing us uh something which we need to identify so question two is saying identify the anatomical structure in one two three and four and then question three is saying name three risk factors for this condition okay so for the answers okay so uh identify the defect in r1 so that's the sister seal so r1 this r1 here that's the sister seal so why so the, why have, uh, have we identified it as a, as the blood from the bladder okay so uh, we need to go through this question for you to understand why so identify the anatomical structures in one two three and four so one this one here is uh as you can see that's the posterior urinary bladder and uh, that's why on the the first one which we had we said this is a sister seal because if the posterior urinary uh, bladder is one uh, the posterior in the anterior one is one which is the anterior bladder is one which is uh, visible in the anterior vagina wall. Okay, that's the that's the bladder. Okay, the posterior urinary bladder. That's the one we are actually visualizing. So that's why it became a swiss to seal. Okay, and then then two that's the rectum. Okay, and then three that's the uh, uterus then four that's the urinary uh bladder as in the the urinary bladder okay then three uh name three risk factors for so let me just clear up okay so name three risk factors for this condition so of course old age mouth parity uh genetic genetic connective tissues or weaknesses so those that's the uh, picture showing so that's the end of the case study and if you haven't subscribed please subscribe and hit the bell notification okay